Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Rescue Mod V. Today we'll be playing as a lifeguard using a 2015 Chevy Tahoe. With this uh, lifeguard 2015 Chevy Tahoe, the lights on top do not work. That's the only thing that's bad about this vehicle. But the vehicle looks pretty nice, even though the lights don't work. And I think the reason why the lights don't work on this vehicle is because I have ELS in. And I think that's the reason why it doesn't work. But I'm a person that uses ELS, so... I mean, I'm not, I'm not going to take out my ELS just to make this car work. So, this vehicle works, but the just the light bar on top, the yellow light bar, does not work. Um, so, we won't be running any lights as far as the light bar or anything like that. And, uh, yeah, we'll be, we'll be responding to cardiac arrest. We'll be just kind of watching the beach, make sure there's no shark attacks or everybody's doing okay and all that. Uh, we'll be stationed out here in Vespucci Beach at a lifeguard tower. We have an option to use a uh, 2015 Tahoe or a four-wheeler, which we won't be using the four-wheeler. We'll just use the 2015 Tahoe. Anyways, uh, so that's pretty much it. We're just going to be doing uh, a lifeguard patrol or whatever you're going to call it. And uh, I know you guys probably see that rescue mod V uh, 0.3 B by the creator of the mod. I'm pretty sure you guys can see that, that the logo there is in the way again. I apologize about that. I'm not sure why it does that. Uh, in my last, not my last episode, I don't remember what episode it was. In my EMS with the one with the ambulance, uh, it was the logo was in the way of the video. So I do apologize. My last episode, it wasn't in the way. Now this episode is in the way. It, I don't know, it's just weird. I'm not sure why it does that. But anyways, the uh, link in the description for this vehicle if you want to use it. We'll go ahead and just make ourselves available. Uh, yep, okay, so now we're available. We'll just LG3 wait. LG3 okay. respond to a cardiac arrest address is Palomino Avenue. Okay, be so advised. we're getting a call coming in. Uh, we're LG3, so lifeguard 3. Uh, LG3, you can show me responding to that. We're going to be responding to a cardiac arrest just right down the road. Well, just right down the beach. We're going to go ahead and just turn around here. and I don't want to wreck into these guys' floats and beach towels and stuff. I'm going to go ahead and just drive up here on the road. That way we don't run into people or any of their stuff. It's just going to be right down the road. I'm just going to get on the road here. LG3, you can show me on scene of that cardiac arrest. I believe it's going to be on the beach. I think um, somebody is not, somebody's having a heart attack here. Where, where they are? Okay, I see him. Right here. LG3, show me on scene. LG3, I'm going to be out with a white male here. He's going to be down at this time, not breathing. Hello, sir. I'm with the, uh, I'm a lifeguard here at the beach. I don't know if you can hear me or not, but I'm going to go and start CPR on you. Could we have another lifeguard on scene here? Why did these guys not respond to this then? They could have dealt with this guy. I mean, they're right here beside him. And my tower is down there. Okay, we're going to go ahead and start CPR here and see if he's uh, deceased. LG3 requesting EMS okay, we have, on uh, scene. EMS. Okay, he's breathing. He's 10%. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and let you guys know. Uh, EMS does not care about anybody's belongings on the beach or doesn't care about anybody. So you'll see EMS fly through here and wreck this stuff. Just to let you guys know. Because I played this off camera and they are just ridiculous. They just ran into people and their belongings they have on the beach. They just don't even care. See, here they come. Okay, let's check his percent. Okay, he's 11% not breathing. 12% uh, now. Medical is almost on scene. We're going to go ahead and lift him up. 13% now. Alright, sir, if you can hear me, go ahead and... St okay, come on. Hopefully medical can get out here and take him to the hospital. Alright, sir, go ahead and stand up for me if you can. Medical is on scene for you, man. I'm sure they'll take care of you and take you to the hospital. Get you taken care of, alright? Just go ahead and hop in that ambulance there. EMS will take care of the victim and you can update your status. Alright. Uh, thank you guys for coming out and uh, assisting me with this. Appreciate it. Okay, looks like we can go back um, to our uh, lifeguard tower and make ourselves available. So, let's see. Um, LG3, LG3, you can show me a... Show me available. Okay, we have another call just coming LG3 in right now. LG3, respond to a cardiac arrest. Another cardiac arrest. Okay, okay, so we have another... Another heart attack uh, just right down the road, or just right down the beach. I keep saying road, but I guess I'm so used to trolling on the road. So we're going to just uh, go down here to this beach, to uh, down down some more down the beach, more south of the beach, and we'll go ahead and 
see what's going on. There's another uh, cardiac arrest. I'm just gonna let you guys know, lifeguards. Uh, this this lifeguard mod or whatever you want to call it, it's part of the rescue mod. But uh, as you play as a lifeguard, you when you play as a lifeguard, you're gonna respond mostly to cardiac arrest. That's mostly what you do. LG3, show me on scene. LG3, you can show me out. Uh, show me on scene. We out with a uh, white male here. Hello, sir. Um, I'm a lifeguard here at VSBG Beach. Um, I don't know if you can hear me or not, but I'm going to go ahead and start uh, CPR on you. The Tahoe looks pretty nice for being a lifeguard. I mean, it is nice. I mean, I, I, I'm, I, I don't know. It's, just, it's nice, but the thing is, I hate the light bar does not work. I'm not sure why it does that, but most of my vehicles I put in for a lifeguard does not work. LG3 not sure why. requesting EMS on EMS scene. EMS is going to be in, on scene, or not on scene, but in route. Okay, so he's um, now breathing. Uh, that's his status. It's 12%. I'm going to go ahead and continue doing CPR on him. I believe I see EMS going the wrong way down there. Maybe that's the other EMS going back out to the hospital. Where is EMS at? We're taking an awful long time to get here. He's 13% not breathing still. Where is EMS at? Come on. I hear the sirens. I don't know if that's the one that is going out. Oh, there they are. Okay, we're going to go just wait until they uh, get on scene and then we'll go ahead and uh, lift them back up. Come on, EMS. Taking forever. He's 24%, still not breathing. I'm going to go ahead and lift him up. Alright, sir, if you can stand up for me, that would be great. Medical is just right down the road. LG3, uh, looks like the subject here is uh, able to uh, sit up for us. So I'm going to try to get him to stand up and I'm going to be standing by for medical. I think medical is uh, stuck. Yeah, medical looks like they're stuck. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and just stand by for medical. We're going to wait until... Okay, so he's gonna wait on medical. I'm not sure what's going on there. They're keep wrecking to that wall. I'm gonna go ahead and just stand by for them. And uh, once they get on scene, then we're just gonna keep an eye on him, make sure he doesn't fall back down or anything. And we're just gonna keep an eye on him, and we'll just wait till medical comes over here. We'll just stand by. So I'll just uh, we'll just go ahead and make ourselves available, and we'll just stand by and wait on EMS. So it looks like we're getting another report of cardiac arrest. It's kind of stupid that they keep. Uh, getting cardiac arrest because that's kind of not realistic because I mean there wouldn't be that many heart attacks in like an hour so we're gonna go ahead and just respond to this cardiac arrest it's just right down the uh, beach it's gonna be kind of on the same spot that the last one that we did not the last one but the one before then LG3 show, LG3, me, on show me on scene it's gonna be a white female here Hello, ma'am, with the uh, lifeguard for the Vespucci Beach. Uh, if you can't, I don't know if you can hear me or not, but I'm gonna go ahead and try to start CPR on you. Try to get you back up. So we're gonna go ahead and start CPR. Try to get her back into a stable condition. I'm not sure what her status is or, or uh, her condition is, but we're gonna go ahead and start CPR and see what her uh, condition is. LG. We also could use that uh, sea shark out there. Uh, that jet ski, uh, but I'm not really sure what we could use it for. Okay, so um, another thing is about this mod. Well, not okay. She's gonna be dead, so her status is gonna be deceased. Pronounced dead on scene. So another thing about this mod, if you play as a lifeguard, uh, it is the most glitchiest one I've ever seen. I mean, we still have um, we still have that EMS from earlier from that. Um, what do you call it? Uh, that that um, cardiac arrest that we had at one time, the first time, yeah, we still have that. Um, what do you call it? That uh, EMS still there, and then we still have the other EMS down there from earlier that kept getting stuck or whatever. That EMS is still there. They never go away until you get off the game and come back on here. And this EMS will stay here as well. But uh, looks like she's gonna be pronounced dead on scene. So I want to go and just um, make herself available as well. Why is it not letting me make myself available? 
I guess I'm supposed to get out and talk to them. Okay, they're starting CPR on her. I'm not sure why. And they took out their umbrellas. So yeah, there's not much you can really do as a lifeguard. Uh, it's just mostly cardiac arrest is what you respawn to. Which, you know, after some time, it kind of gets boring doing the same exact thing. So it kind of sucks playing as a lifeguard unless you do the Coast Guard, which is the one with the helicopter. Then you respawn to uh, cardiac arrest or MVAs, and, and then you also respawn to sinking boats and things like that. So we'll go ahead and just make ourselves available. I'll just wait until I get back to my tower because I'm sure they're going to give me another call if I go ahead and, and say that we're uh, available. So looks like she's going to be pronounced dead on scene. That corner will be dispatched out here to pick her up. So we'll go ahead and just head back to our lifeguard tower and we'll go ahead and just wait for another call or we might patrol around the beach and see what's going on. So we'll just go ahead and make ourselves available. LG3 respond to a cardiac arrest address is Goma Street be advised. Okay, so we're getting another call for a cardiac arrest. Let's see, where's the location? It's going to be um, near the other tower over here, but it's going to be um, kind of in the same area we've been responding to. We're kind of, we're way far away. We're down here. I've been kind of tr trying to patrol around looking for anybody that's getting attacked by sharks. So, um, uh, LG3, you can show me respond to a cardiac arrest. Um, it's going to be, uh, let's, let's see. It's going to be on the uh, Pacific Ocean. Closest block number is 5031. So we'll, we'll be responding to a cardiac arrest. We've got a little ways to go, just a mile out from the location. We're just going to drive on the beach all the way down to the uh, location. We're going to try to hurry up and get there. And hopefully we can save them. Uh, the last one we did, uh, unfortunately they died on the scene. Hopefully coroner services picked up the body. I don't think they did though, but we'll go ahead and just uh, drive around this bike bicyclists here this is more of a um, this is more for bicycles and runners than for lifeguards but I mean usually the lifeguards drive on the beach but uh, I guess I, I still I guess I could still drive here it says bikes only back there but I guess the lifeguard could still drive on the road here I mean usually um, some beaches the lifeguards just drive on the beach like this oh didn't mean to jump that but uh, yeah so some of the lifeguards just drive on the beach here as you guys can see, the uh, EMS are still here from earlier, which I mean, it's kind of a glitch. So the, I don't think the loft card's the best thing to play as. I mean, look at that. Still got the EMS there from earlier, and then that EMS from the earlier, and I believe the body's still out there. No, I don't. I don't see it. But we'll go ahead and just. Um, that makes no sense why they want me out here when they have loft cards out here. Like there's a loft card tower, and there's some loft cards here. So, uh, LG3, you can show me on LG3 scene. LG3, show me a white female. Hello, ma'am. I'm with the lifeguard of uh, Pacific Ocean and Vespucci. I'm not, I'm not sure if you can hear me or not, but I'm going to go and start CPR on you, alright? So, we're going to go ahead and treat him for, uh, we'll just go ahead and do CPR for a heart attack. Yeah, I'm, I'm not really sure why they want us out here or they dispatch us out here. When we have, um, lifeguards, there's a lifeguard right beside her, and we was a mile out from the location. It kind of makes no sense. LG3 requesting EMS on scene. I think for the last one, uh, for the last cardiac arrest that we'll take, we'll go out, we'll go out to the ocean and drive a jet ski, and, uh, we'll try to get dispatched out here to the beach, and then we'll just drive the jet ski, um, to the, cl like, close to the beach, and then we'll get off the jet ski and then, uh, go to the scene. So it looks like the status is not breathing. Um, it's going to be 13%. The percentage is going up pretty quick. So I'm going to go ahead and get, I think medical's already. Yeah, medical's over there. Looks like they're getting stuck again. So I'm going to go ahead and just try to lift them up here. All right, ma'am, if you can uh, sit up for me and stand up for me, that would be great. Uh, probably the next time when we do a lifeguard, we'll probably try to do a helicopter. Um, but I'm not sure if I'll do it or not because... If I do a helicopter, it has to be the Mavic stock, uh, the Mavic one, uh, with the medical livery on it, which, I mean, uh, it's not the best helicopter, but I'll try to find me a helicopter. I have a Coast Guard helicopter, but it doesn't really, um, hold on just a minute. All right, ma'am, uh, EMS will just uh, take care of you. They're just right there if they ever will come over here and get you, but looks like you'll be okay. Medical, take care of you, all right? Uh, LG3, you can show me uh, available, and I'll be backing around to the um, lifeguard tower. So, uh, yeah, like I said, that the um, 
the helicopter that I had in the game, I actually have it in the game right now, but it's a Coast Guard helicopter and it's uh, meant for like uh, sinking boats and things like that. It doesn't work like it, I had it working and then it doesn't work now. Like I don't know what, what's going on with it. Like every time I spawn it in, it crashes my game. So I can't use that helicopter, which I wish I could. Uh, it would be pretty cool to use that helicopter, but I might be able to find me another helicopter y to use for like a um, some kind of like lifeguard patrol or something like that, like uh, respond to seeking boats and things like that. But I don't know if I'll be able to do that since uh, there's not that really that many helicopters that are really good. So there's a jet ski over there. We're gonna go over there. Let's just go over here back to our. I think this is our tower. Yeah, this is our tower. Or maybe that's it down there. Now I think this is our tower because we have the four wheeler. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and just park the SUV. We're gonna go ahead and just grab the um, the four wheeler here. We're gonna head over there to that jet ski, and we'll just leave our uh, four wheeler. Um, we'll probably leave the four wheeler up here. I mean, I don't think nobody will steal it. Yeah, there we go. We'll just go ahead and leave it here. We'll go ahead and hop on the jet ski, and uh, I'm gonna make ourselves. There we go. I didn't want to get in trouble for the stealing that jet ski. I mean, it's not, I'm not really stealing it. I'm part of the lifeguard, but we're going to go ahead and just uh, hop on this uh, jet ski here. Hopefully, we don't get attacked by the sharks. But yeah, we'll go ahead and hop on this jet ski. It's a lifeguard jet ski. Uh, we'll go ahead and just uh, patrol around here on the ocean, make sure nobody's drowning or anything. And uh, we'll go ahead and just make ourselves available and see what we can get into. LG3 respond to a cardiac arrest address is Gomez Street be advised. So looks like we're getting reports of another cardiac arrest. It's just going to be right here. Oh, we got to watch out. We're going to go ahead and just exit out or exit off of this uh, jet ski here and go ahead and just uh, hurry up and respond to this. LG3, you can show me on scene. LG3, show me on scene. Where's the body at? Did I pass it? I'm guessing it's this guy, yeah. LG3, you can show me out the white male here. He's going to be um, not braiding that this time. Alright, sir. I'm with the uh, lifeguard of uh, Vespucci Beach in Pacific Ocean. I'm going to go ahead and start CPR on you, alright? I'm going to go ahead and just uh, start CPR. I'm going to check and see what his status is. LG3 requested okay, we're going to have uh, medical on C. Uh, in route. Looks like 11% not breathing. I'm going to try to lift him up here. Where's the medical app? Okay, there's so many ambulances, I don't even know which one it, it could be. I guess it's this one. And they're stuck in the, uh, with the light bar, and, uh, not light bar, but uh, a light pole and a four-wheeler. Okay, now they made it up here. Okay. Alright, sir, go ahead and stand up for me. Okay. Looks like uh, medical is on scene for you. They'll go ahead and take care of you, alright? You have a good day. Hopefully you can uh, get better and hopefully everything works out for you, alright? Thank you guys for coming out and picking them up for me. Alright, LG3, you can show me available. I'm going to be heading back to my tower. Uh, but we're going to go and end the episode right here. So I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, episode of uh, Rescue Mod V. I know it's probably not the greatest episode. I, In my opinion, it's probably not the greatest ep episode since uh, we mostly responded to cardiac arrest. Which, in my opinion, I mean, that could get kind of boring because we respond to the same calls. Uh, but I don't know. Hopefully, hopefully you guys still enjoyed it, regardless of uh, us for take, taking the same calls, because that's the only call you get when you respond as a lifeguard, unless you're playing as a coast guard. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed it, anyways. If you uh, enjoyed it, be sure to leave a like on the video and be sure to subscribe down below if you want to see more Rescue Mod uh, V episodes. And be sure to comment down below your thoughts of what you thought of this episode. And I'm not sure if we'll continue doing lifeguard. We will probably do Coast Guard, maybe. I'm not sure. Uh, we'll just have to see. Uh, but anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.